Hey, what's going on fam? My name is Brennan Myers and welcome to this episode of The Road to Recovery. Now, if you're new here and new to The Road to Recovery series, over a year ago, I injured various parts of my body, severe injuries, and on top of that, I had surgeries and I also got sick in multiple times. So I lost 40 pounds during the last year, but then I gained 40 pounds back and I've been documenting my journey ever since. And so I'm gonna show you my strength gains and show you my power and development as I progress and show you you when I get back to bodyweight training how much stronger and more powerful I am so let's jump right into this episode right now so I started off with some foam rolling all over my body but more specifically I took a specific tennis ball or lacrosse ball put it under my foot and what this does is really your foot is always being worked right your muscles are so tense under that foot and it just releases the area it really releases all the way up towards your spine and through your spine so try it out yourself into that I went into multiple exercises super set so I was hitting some inverted rows from a 28 inch box or you could just use a bench like I was using and so what this is doing is really putting me at a decline and forcing a lot more gravity onto my chest area which then means hey it's gonna be a lot tougher for that inverted row and then I moved straight into single arm dumbbell press and this is where I'm so excited because I was doing 80 pounds 80 pounds for about 10 repetitions and I haven't been able to do anything close to this weight for over a year I wasn't even able to do any type of bench or push exercises even a push-up for 10 months but here I am really building some strength back and soon enough I'm gonna be over in the hundreds okay and then from here from this single arm thumb up press moving to the other exercises that I'm so excited to engage in and as you can see right here you know I I'm just working and, and that's the truth behind it you know I'm doing some single arm dumbbell presses and uh, or sorry rows single arm dumbbell rows and I haven't been able to row a lot of weight either but here I I am hitting 80 plus pounds for 12 repetitions, really stabilizing. And then I was moving into some yoga push-ups from a higher bench position, just like those inverted rows. But here's just one leg. Super excited to hit this movement. Try it out yourself, it burns like crazy. And then I went into a movement where you pull all the way diagonally, all the way across your body, all the way up, keeping that other opposite arm completely straight, and then you press out. And this is really gonna stabilize in a specific position, allow your rotator cuff muscles your posterior capsule to work on one side and on the other side really work the, the the shoulder in a way where it's not putting a lot of pressure on that bicep tendon and that's what I needed to focus on for this movement so I made that happen because of Eric Cressy appreciate that man so that is my workout I did many other exercises but I wanted to guide you through those specific exercises that I just showed you I also did some TRX Y's which I killed I really love those movements um, you should try it on it yourself just get a TRX and and search wise TRX wise on YouTube and see how they work for you I'm gonna keep on showing you my strength gains today was absolutely incredible I've, I've built so much strength already and I haven't really had any pain in my shoulder throughout all these movements which means I'm progressing more and more and so that's pretty much it for today's episode thank you for tuning in I love you guys comment down below if you enjoy these videos give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you next time peace